Hey guys, welcome in this video. I hope that all of you are doing right. So in this video, I will share with you guys one of the ways that I've actually been able to improve my trading result. This is something that I started to do a couple of years ago and that I'm still doing today and trying to do it even more and more and more as time goes by. And every time that I just implement this, well, even more, as I said, um, my results just improve, right? And everything gets better, right? So I'm really excited to share it with you. I think it will be very very variable for you guys so just before that we start as always guys feel free to drop a like on the video i would really appreciate it and make sure as well that you are subscribed to the channel if it's not already done so let's dive right into today's topic right so what i want to explain you guys is how to actually improve your performance metrics right so when we talk about performance metrics essentially what we are talking about is the risk to reward ratio it's the win rate and stuff like that right so really the numbers that at the end of the day will dictate the results that you get right so how many trades you win versus how many trade you lose and how much you win when you win versus how much you lose when you lose right these are all very very important metrics sorry for the microphone <laughs> And um, the idea here, right, will be to actually improve these numbers to try to become better in your trading, right? So what you have to focus on in order to do this, right, and that is exactly what I did as well in my trading, is to focus on taking high quality trade setups and removed as many uh, trades as possible, right? So in other words, you want to take the least amount of trades in your trading, right? And I know that this sounds maybe not so common, right? In the sense that a lot of people believe at the beginning, right? When they get into trading, that the more trades they take, the better they will do, right? And that is totally wrong, okay? And I've also believed this for a long time until I realized how bad of an idea it was, right? But it's a very common idea, right? And you know, if we don't really dive into the idea, right? It's kind of logical, right? You take more trades, so you make more money. But in reality, it's the total opposite, all right? So you need to change this belief of taking a lot of trades to grow the account fast, all right? This is what a lot of people again think. Whereas what you actually have to do is to take the least amount of trades possible and only to focus on high quality trade setups, right? And so as you focus on these better opportunities, while well, your performance metrics will actually improve. So you will have a better win rate and you will have a better risk to reward ratio on average, right? And so with these better performance metrics, that is how you will be able to grow your account, right? Now, if you want to grow it faster, right? And that is oftentimes what people will refer to as taking more trades and the, the purpose of taking more trades, right? Well, if you want to grow your account faster, it's not about taking more trades, right? It's about focusing on the performance metrics which at the end gives you the results that you have and then it's only about risk management right so if you want to grow an account faster well there is no magic formula guys you just need to take more risk on the trades that you actually take right and so instead of taking for example just one percent of risk per trade you could take two percent or three percent or four percent right and stuff like that and so what you also have to understand here is that someone who takes a lot of trades right well, they will need to split the risk in between all of these trades, right? Because let's say someone that takes, I don't know, like three trades per day or five trades per day, right? Someone that, you know, does day trading and stuff like that, right? Well, of course, they cannot risk, let's say, 3% per trade, right? I mean, they're not going to risk 15% or 30% on their account in one day. I mean, it would be just way too much, right? So as you take more and more trades, you actually need to decrease the risk that you put on, on these trades right whereas if you take less trades you can put more risk on these trades without overall taking too much risk on your trading account right so you see that even if you reduce the amount of trades that you take it doesn't necessarily decrease the returns that you will get right because if you take less trades you are able to put more capital on these trades and then getting more capital on high quality trade setups will actually help you to get better results over time, right? So essentially, that's the idea. It's really, really important to understand the dynamic between taking less trades, getting better results, right? Because again, right, just if you take a lot of trades, right, well, your risk will be all over the place and it will be across what we call suboptimal trades, right? So positions that are not 
really that good, right? They could be decent, but they are not the best, right? So instead of doing this, what you can do is focus only and strictly on the best of the best of the best opportunities and just put more risk on these uh, trades if you want to still grow your account faster, right? And essentially that's how really you get better results over time. And as I said, this is something guys that I've really started to implement a couple of years ago and that I'm still trying to push more and more and more, right? So in my own trading, I really try to take the least amount of trades possible, right? I'm only focusing on high quality opportunities and I don't really care, you know, about the little trades here and there because I know that these little trades will not make a big difference at the end of the day, even if they come out to be profitable, right? So what I'm focusing on, is really big opportunities with a very strong fundamental idea and a very good technical analysis as well. And then focusing only on these opportunities, again, improve my performance metrics. And this is how I get much better results over time, right? Because in trading, yes, it's about growing your account, but it's also about protecting what you have and not getting into a big drawdown or a big losing streak, for example. And so the way to actually um, avoid these negative situations is to have better performance metrics. So that you win more often you win more when you win than when you lose and then over time right the probabilities will be much more on your side and that is how you will be able to grow your account over the medium to long term um so yeah that's essentially right the concept that i wanted to share with you guys pretty simple overall but very very important and i'm telling you right a lot of people watching this video right now i know that you guys are taking way too many trades okay it's for sure, okay, like it's a very, very, very common mistake. I was doing this mistake for years, right? I was profitable and I was making this mistake. You see what I mean? Like it's not something that is necessarily going to block you from being profitable or not. But again, in trading, right, and in business and everything, right, your goal should be to optimize everything to get the best results possible, right? And so that's exactly what you have to do here if you actually want to get these better results, right? And I'm telling you guys, it's really, really important. It makes a massive difference, right? So guys, after watching this video take a step back and really ask yourself this question right am i actually taking just too many trades for no reason or do i really really focus on only amazing opportunities right and i can tell you that most of you guys watching this video will be able to find trades that you should probably not be taking right and that are not really good and if you are able to cut these trades then your results will automatically improve i think that it's probably one of the fastest ways to actually just get better results overall right it's simply to remove the bad trades right or remove the least probable and that is how really you improve the performance metrics and at the end of the day this is what matters the most so guys i hope you enjoyed this video a pretty short one all right but i just wanted to share this with you i had this inspiration this morning and i wanted to record this video today for you guys so i hope you enjoyed it if you did please again leave a like under the video make sure that you share it around as well and on that take care trade with care manage your money well and i will see you in my next video bye bye